It was a real battle at the MCG in every way. As you heard Lewin uh, Jack mention early, the lead changed 18 times during the game, and players played as though it was a grand final. There's a long and short of it. There's McMahon going through a wild hand pass out, but well intercepted this time by Bruce and Oh, there's a slight disagreement between Grambo and Beecroft. Everybody was on a short fuse all day. Back to Serafini, Fitzroy batting it. Oh, what a round of chops. Well, uh, you know that fella Gaunt that went down like a bag of spuds. It was Dickinson got him by mistake. And the long one up the uh, Beecroft. This is a game for Richardson. He's got a chance to score if he's good enough. He's hit the post. Oh! In the post as he kicked it off the ground. This time it'll go to foul of Denny and an under. Richardson not too happy with things. Thanks, Richardson. Down. Not too happy. And, uh, got that and a couple of dashes. Firstly, That's Allen for Fitzroy. Allen from the centre wing position shows a good turn of speed. There's nobody within Cooey. He's well shepherded at two. A long hand pass from Allen to McMahon towards Carmen territory. Half and then Merrigan gets in the dashing uh, business. One taken by Merrigan. He's taken the points in that duel so far. Harvey Merrigan, a great player. And the speed that he's showing here. Makes you, uh, well, you can understand